Do you know that God wants us to ask for gifts, for help? God does, but so often we don't. In John 16, verse 24, it says, Ask in my name. That's, that means ask in my name, ask in my nature. Ask in a total belief that when you ask, it will be coming to you. Ask in total faith. Now I continue. According to my will, and God will most certainly give to you. Your joy will be like a river overflowing its banks. What a beautiful line that is. Your joy will be like a river overflowing its banks. It can't be contained. St. Jerome said, It is our part to seek God to grant what we wish and ask. Our part is to make a beginning. That's key. You have free will on whether to ask or not to ask, on whether to accept or reject. God can bring everything to completion. Our part is to offer what we can, God to finish what we can't. Well, God continually, daily, offers us gifts, and we should accept them, and yet often we do not. Why? I think it's because we fail to trust God completely, because we are at times <laughs> rather inflexible. Have you ever been inflexible? Oh boy, I have. God has plans for us, but sometimes we resist. And when we do, we, pray, we pay a price for our short-sightedness. In John 16, 24, God promises that when we ask for things in God's name, God will respond. God will not withhold God's gifts when we ask for them. But we must ask for them. We must. If we're wise, we'll ask them in an expectant way, in total faith, not in negativity. I often have prayer requests like this. Oh, God, I don't believe that you'll do this for me. I don't think it will happen in a million years. But here's what I think won't happen. Please make it happen. Amen. <laughs> That's the most negative type of prayer you could make. Positive Christianity, of course, answers back in the affirmative of what that person can have if they'll only accept it totally in faith. And in spirituality, you have to accept it in advance in order to have it. Are you a person who asks God to move mountains in your life, or are you expecting God to stumble over molehills? Whatever the size of your needs, I'm telling you, my friend, God can meet them. Whatever the size of your obstacles, God can help you overcome them. Ask for God's help this day.